keep forgetting to switch what day we're on. Oh well. <clears throat> Okie doke. Oh, I keep. <laughs> I keep started the stream and not realizing you guys are already in here. Alright, I should close this also. Bye. Yeah, last time I had an enlightening experience. <clears throat> oh, right, dang it. Okay, oh, like, look, I keep recording, because, like, Luna needs to record Tinykin. So, like, I let her do that, just, I keep forgetting to switch it back to streaming mode. Last time, I found an apparently rare guy. Hi, Glimmeru. And, uh, right. Yeah, I don't need to go into Porky Poke Portal to connect, just go. Alrighty. Okay. Oh, I guess they're vanishing because they're too close to the Pokemon Center. Okay, there's the invisible snow rat. Hi. Okay, anyway. <clears throat> now, is that going to connect me to your game or m mine? Oh, wait, right, we're, right, we're trading first. Duh, 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 duh. Doi. Uh, figured. Yeah, I'm gonna trade. Code. Right. Yeah, because I figured I uh, might as well have Seth give me. I connected to Seth. Sure am. Okay, uh. Why are those guys glowing? Oh, are those version exclusives? That glow? I guess I gotta give you one of these squawk ability or something. Well, no, because Iron Treads is glowing, and that's ver I imagine that's version exclusive. Oh, okay, 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 okay. So, uh, I don't know. Bagon's not that hard to. Fine in my version, so I guess you can have it. Have your bacon. I should have named it, but oh well. Yeah, we're just gonna trade Frigidbacks, so I don't have to like, go running around for it <laughs> for it anymore. It's like I would have had it. I would have had it, and I would have ended the stream and be like, "Cool, I got it." But no, I had to use Power Gem on what something I knew was an Ice type for whatever dang reason. Is that the baby form of the pseudo legendary of this gen? Because it has that energy. Okay. Yeah. 
Look at that frame rate. I mean, cutting the luxury ball and everything. Fridge backs. Got him. Ice fin. This Pokemon lives in forests and craggy areas. Using the power of its dorsal fin, it cools the inside of its nest like a refrigerator. Huh. It kind of looks like baby Godzilla. Like Godzilla Jr. Okay, anyway. I'm gonna go ahead and Union Circle now. Sure. Form a group. Yeah. Okay, so Seth's gonna join and do things in the background. I like go about story stuff because he needs version exclusive stuff, and apparently you can access version exclusive stuff by joining someone else's game, so that's fun. I might <laughs> I might join Seth's game. Uh, toward the end when we need to go hunting for the Paradox Pokemon. I was like, I thought I'd just have to, like, react to those by looking at images of them, but uh, apparently I could just go find them in Seth's game. Alright, let's go with this. Oh yeah, that. How do you evolve Palafin? Exactly. It's just level up all playing co-op. Jimmy don't know the Charizard pose anymore. Oh hey, we match. Oh yours is bigger, I think. Is it bigger? No, phase on, get over here. Yeah, yours is like slightly bigger. Darn. Okay, uh, what was. Oh, yeah, right. Uh, box. Okay, give me Frigibax for a sec so I can evolve it, because apparently it's ready to evolve. And where is my Palafin? Or Finizen? Okay, um... Hubba hubba hubba. Can you evolve off a small... Maybe a couple smalls. There we go. And then phase on ceased to be. Okay, what's your awkward medieval look like? You have a, like an ice shaped beauty mark for some reason. And you just have an ice face. What is that thing on its wrist? It attacks with the blade of its frozen dorsal fin by doing a front flip in the air. Arctabax's strong back legs allow it to pull off this technique. Huh. Is this supposed to be a Spinosaurus? Actually, that makes me think. Are there... I have not seen anything about fossil Pokemon in this game. Come to think of it. That kind of looks like a mix of Godzilla and a Spinosaurus. Lame. Now, that, I guess fair enough that you would count those as fossil, po fossil Pokemon, but still. Okay, anyway... Start leveling you up. 
Ba -ba -ba. Uh, no. Oh, uh, level 38, eh. I don't know if I have enough candy to shove it into its mouth then. Yeah, I might just evolve this later when we got, when we're fighting high, like way higher level Pokemon anyway. Alright. Back to the box with you. And where are you at? There you are. Get Black Ace back in here. I'm sure the champion's gonna have uh, the, the final Evo, the pseudo legendary, anyway. Okay. Wonder why it has to drag you all the way back to Mesa Goza every time. Okay, anyway. All right, back to our own business while Seth does his. Uh, after you beat um, after you beat the Ground Titan, it's like sitting in the same spot, and it's it's basically a legendary battle. Okay, down this way. I swear to God, if I find... I oh, fought you. I swear to God, if we found... Uh... Arctabax down here after all that trouble last night. And then this surrendering and trading anyway. Oh, right. Dang it. I should've just take, took meds before the stream. Again, it's like the stream happened late enough to where I don't really have that excuse. I think it's Seth that's in my game, so if anything, he has an opportunity to go get the Sinisty armor. Come here, pill. ones. Oh, okay. That's kind of lame. But at least you can find, like, version exclusives, whatever those are. I have yet to catch you, so... Unless you're still ridiculously high level. I can your reasonable level. Oh wait, right. You're psychic type. Whoops. Uh, kick back, get out here please. I tricked you. Ba -ba -ba. It makes psychic power from the gaps between its multicolored frills and sprints at speeds greater than 120 miles per hour. Well, hey, we have a proper ostrich Pokemon now. 
the point is like slightly moot when we already have Doe Duo, which is like, I guess fair enough, it's more like a cross between an ostrich and a kiwi, but still. It's me, I'm the strong aura. Phazon will do that to you. The hell? Why is that Tauros mad? Well, hardy horror for you, then, I guess. Toxic debris. Oh, it's not gonna matter because you're not. You don't have more than one. Wait, are there multiple Paldean Tauros? Like, that's not just like a rage state or something? Attack it. Okay, fine. That dog can live on that hill. I was gonna say, I have not seen that. What does the deck say? Can I, can I get a look at it? What's that? I think that's a Ranguru. People call this Tina Tauros the Blaze Breed. To the hot air it snorts from its nostrils, its three tails are intertwined. So what, do you have to breed to get it? Okay then. Weird. Hi, Satoddle. Seth caught a finizen. I bonk this dog on the butt. Appreciate they catch they kept catching Pokemon off guard. From Legends Arceus. Oh, fair enough. Ba, ba, ba. Okay. It is a calm and collected demeanor. It swiftly closes in on prey, then slices them with the rock on its mane. Or rocks in its mane. Blop. Got one of those. I, st I don't think I have a deerling yet, actually. Oh, never mind. I do. Never mind. Okay, uh... Alright, this is that town. I saw and got afraid of. Or not saw and got afraid of, but like moved into this route and then got afraid of that. Oh, hey. Wild Mudsdale. Where are you? Oh, you're just Sneasel. I need Sneasel anyway. You would probably not survive a power gem, so...
fool. You're already faster than me. Hey, we're in. Now, snap it. It's like I encountered this thing by pure chance, and apparently it's like a 1% encounter. <laughs> Lucky me. is a smart and sneaky Pokemon. A pair may work together to steal eggs by having one lure the parents away. Devious. Sneasler wouldn't be a bad Pokemon to use in this game. Now that it'll be properly working on po Pokemon mechanics. I forget which ability it has, but... button. All of them. Games with ten dozen pa pause buttons, I swear. Yeah, how did I get here? Set as destination. I guess it's got something to do with going off to the side there. Okay. We'll figure it out. That's what wandering around's for. Oh yeah, there's Grievard in this area too. I gotta keep out look out for those. At least that's what I saw last time I was here. Great ball, if you say so. Ultra ball, if you say so. What are you? A Sneasel. Uh, we beat the... Uh, last episode we beat the Ground Titan and then... Uh, caught Iron Treads. And then, yeah, I traveled over here, did the normal type gym, and then went through this cave area. That's where I found Glimmit, and uh, we ran, ran around for half an hour looking for the pseudo-legendary and quit before we got it, so Seth gave me it instead. Okay. Oh, X-Scissor. Okay, what terror type are you fighting? Oh, well, that's funnily appropriate. Yeah, Frigidbax. Hmm. Yeah, I guess I just Venom shock you. Oh yeah, I love the Dunsparce, by the way. It's perfect. Is yeah, that like we feel relatively set on what we want to use this as like the team we currently have, unless something comes along that changes our mind, but I don't know. If the final Ouch. If the final uh, Evo of the pseudo looks nice. We might use it for a second playthrough.
Eh, just for the sake of having a fighting one. Even though Sneasler would be... Probably be fighting terror type anyways. Yeah, it's like we're just like doing multiple playthroughs for certain Pokemon games, so that's why we're thinking of it that way. Uh, just auto heal you. Jump on you backwards. That doesn't work. I'll just run over you instead. Oh, fine. Put yourself to sleep. See if I care. Yeah, you fool. Now I can just catch you easy. Yeah, it's part of why we like Sword and Shield so much. It's like, I get why people don't like it, but it's like, it has such an immense Pokemon variety. It's really replayable for us. Okay. When Cub Chew starts sneezing, watch out! If it spatters you in, with its frosty snot, You'll get frostbite. Way to make it scary. Okay, uh, what is... Oh, Snom. Snarm. Why not? Okay, whatever. No! You're too powerful. How could you? How could you do this to Snom? I have no way to gently take you out. Um... Poo poo. Guess I'll throw... I could have thrown a net ball, actually. I think so, yeah. The underneath of the universe looks very lovely tonight. Ooh, Snom Thread. Within its internal organs, Snom amplifies the frigid air it gets from eating snow and then uses this amplified air to create icicle-like spikes. Oh, Snom. You are peak critter design. Okay, right. Do I just drop down from here to get to... I don't know, I can barely see. Thanks, Snowstorm. Oh, hi, Go Goats. How you doing? Yeah, I ran into it because I can't see anything. Where am I? Okay, I'm over. Oh, there's Mimikyu around here. Neat. Okay, fall down. Uh, stop by a cutscene. There he be. Mm. 
Vixie. Eh, whatever, I'll play his game. Glad to see you got my name committed to memory. Now, let's pick up our conversation where we both left both off. Left, both left off. As I mentioned, I joined Operation Starfall to resolve a sticky situation and to find out the reasons behind Team Star's odd behavior. Above all, I want to know why the students in Team Starfall have stopped coming to school. And, just like Cassiopeia, I want the team to disband for good. Since joining Operation Starfall with you, I've already had some success in opening uh, up a dialogue with Team Star. And I think I'm starting to understand things more clearly. But I don't have enough information just yet. And that's why I want to speak with students from Team Starfall's other squads as well. If you intend to take on another base, know that you can count on me for backup. Till then, see you around, Vixie. Sure. Oh, this is the I I uh, Grafi I Forest. Okay. Shrewdal. That's how you're doing. I probably should have switched. Do me a favor and go home already, will you? No! I want to see the boss of the Navi squad. Uh, take me on, Don Atticus. Like I said, kid, the boss told me not to let you, any outsiders pass these gates. That includes you. I don't care. I'm not leaving till you let me talk to Don Atticus. Give me a break, you little doofus. Yeah, sure. I can just waltz up and beat your butt. Oh, great. Here comes another rando to ruin my day. I didn't think grunt work for Team Star newbies would be this much of a chore. Hold on, Mr. Grunch. I think this girl might be Vixie. Wait, Vixie? That kid who picked a fight with Team Star? I knew it. Oh boy, this ain't good. Everybody else in the base is still asleep since we were all up all last night playing video games. Relatable. Hear me, Mr. Grunt. I'll buy some time for you while you go wake up the others. Yeah? What's in it for you? Don Atticus will be in danger if there's no if no one's here to defend the base. I owe that man my life. He's my dear compadre. And when crisis calls, no one has, one has no choice but to rally to those dear to him, no matter the cost. Yeah, I have no idea what you're on about, kid. But thanks for the big assist. All right, you villain. If you're after Don Atticus, be prepared to face my wrath. Okay. Yeah! Oh, it still plays the t Team Star fight music. What is the name yourself? Yousef. I'm not hyper prepared for a poison raid, but I guess we'll make it work out. Especially if you're gonna one-shot him. Eh, sure got her tropic scoff. Finally, we get to hear the Team Star theme at length. Farigaraf is good. 
I talk big, but I'm no warrior. Don Atticus, I'm sorry I failed you. Vixie, are you alright? I was standing watch and I heard a ruckus all of a sudden. I got worried that maybe something had happened to you over here. Ah, no fair! You had backup this whole time! Is this boy one of the Academy's students? He doesn't look like he's from Team Star. You're right, I'm not a member of Team Star. Don Atticus is my compadre! I have to see him, no matter what. Well, clearly you have your reasons for being here. Fixie, I'd like to ask this boy some questions. You go ahead and start, get started on the base. Might I borrow you for a chat, my, uh, my man? Don't worry, I don't buy it. Nice work dealing with the guard. Within that base lies Team Star's poison crew, the Navi Squad. Their boss, Atticus, designs the outfits for the team. You could say he has clever hands. The guy is also a bit of an eccentric. You can tell what's go you can never tell what he's do going to do next. So, since it's beyond us to predict how he'll respond to our declaration of war, just take out as m many of as many of the squad's Pokemon as you can until Atticus shows his face. Ring the bell on the gates once you're ready to kick off this phase of the operation. Time to wipe the Navi squad off the map. Oh, that stinks. Darn. Okay, uh, Dream. Shake my team slightly here. Yeah, you obviously wouldn't help, but you would. There he goes. Uh, let me heal you real fast. Boink. He jumped the fence. He's in. Alrighty. Yeah, it's like Seth joined the try and find version exclusives, but apparently it doesn't work quite as well. Some of the folks behind Operation Star FOOL! Oh shit, he got us. Or finally making a move against our base. You know what that means, gang? Time for us to shine bright and avenge our teammates. And hey, little intruder, just so you know, if you got the skills to defeat 30 of our Pokemon in 10 minutes, our boss might deem you worthy to meet in person. <laughs> Break a leg. Alrighty. I have a psychic type, so... Okay. Beat him up, Trough. Okay, you can kind of deal with them also. That's Shrudel. I guess that's Shrudel. Alright, oh, look at all these Grafii. They're bigger than I thought they'd be. I thought they'd be tiny because they're eye eyes. Get him. Oh, they got Claude Sire. We're fucked. Uh, I want to. Can I switch? I can't seem to sw like switch, switch. Cause like I don't want 
to set my guys at, my fire guys out uh, at ground types. Okay. Fine. Okay, no longer walled. Got him. Oh, my fire guys deal with this. Yeah, I know, right? being a bad team for this. They're just gonna have a bunch of Pokemon that coincidentally are weak to fire. You know, Claude Sire notwithstanding. Okay, got him. I guess I didn't have to take out Claude Sire, but that's their strongest weapon. She's way above our level! We've got to get the boss. Hey, I oh, know that's a neat paint job, I guess. You're probably the most gender out of the Team Star Screw we've seen so far. Game, you live? Okay. Pray for... Pray... Pray forgive my sudden entry. Tis I, Atticus. You're that scoundrel Vixie, I take it. You have some nerve bearing your fangs at Team Star. Come then, villainous wretch. A plunge into the grim poison shall be your well deserved fate. On guard. I can't help but find it funny that music is actually kind of timed to the, the, the long loading time. Uh, that, this is not ideal. Not but punishment awaits thee, wretch. A plague on your house! Okay then. Uh, you're weak to poison, but you got the ground moves. I probably should have seen if Phazon can learn ground moves. Ha ha. Dum dum. I mean, that's probably not going to mean much, because that Starmobile is probably also Steel-type, or Poison-type. Oh, that smarts nonetheless. Oh, you have, like, more than two Pokémon. Imagine. Yeah, I know, right? They're all icons. Are you just gonna go straight to Rever Room? Okay. Uh, that can be Trophic Scoff time. Oh, you mean Rever Room, not Rever Room. Okay then. 
It's a shame your Terrastal is a normal type. Okay, that's Combine. Ouch. Yo, dog. We heard you like driver. We heard you like engine Pokemon, so we put a Rever Room on your Rever Room so you can Rever Room while you Rever Room. All right, your part seal. Duh. Oh well, I took it out anyway. Why do you animate like you're from Cars? It's just goofy looking. Uh, nah. Uh, let me heal up real quick. Where did I get all these hyper potions? Not that I'm complaining, but. Mysteriously, your car loses Steel-type somehow. Ouch. I know, I know I got them off the ground, but it's like, did I seriously grab that many? Like, good grave. Eh, the impact hits less when it's the third time in a row. And by now, I'm feeling like the last two Steam Team Star bosses are also gonna be... A Starmobile. Be gone from here. I mean, I know, but it's still like, could you not have had other vehicles, like, come up? Like, they, they could just be, like, different forms of Rever Room still, just, I don't know. Forgive me, my friends. Wow, you are extremely gender. Forgive me, I had a goodly time to... Why do you... You are a word salad person. Time to procure the required materials. Whoa! Sick! These boots are insane! Ah, uh, yes. The move Flame Charge was my muse for those particular pieces. This outfit is everything I imagined it would be. Thank you so much. I merely wish to create a costume worthy of the great Infernal Airy. If it aligns with your vision, then I am content. Thanks to your outfit upgrades, we are all wrapped up then. Thanks a ton, Atticus. With you two looking like absolute beasts, anyone who crosses us will be sweat nuts, sweating bullets. You're so good at these sorts of crafty things, Atticus. 
Those people bullying you because you geek out over old-fashioned stuff are out of their minds. The way of the ninja is rough and fraught with thorns. I neither expect nor desire sympathy from an unrefined rabble. Ah, someone's getting fired up. Watch out, world. Our Atticus is fighting words. Yeah, don't listen to the haters, Atticus. I think you're really cool. Alright, gang. Let's move on to the next step. It's time to put our, our backs into battling tr our battle training so we're all prepped for Operation Star. We got it. Yeah, the, like this, this, t the team squad, the uh, team star admins are just like the average LGBTQ squad, really. We gotta be stronger than everyone else in the team. That's what being boss means. Indeed, it does, Atticus. Henceforth, I devote myself, heart and soul, to honing my battle skills. Oh, Johto confirmed. For the sake of the, of the team, I will give my very heart and soul, but I cannot defy the rules. Our code must be obeyed. And so, this badge is mine to keep no more. I entrust it to thy care. Don't be rude. Peeking a look under the hood. Take this contraption too. It contains a technique that allows one to cover their foes in gunk. Like some kind of gunk shot. Vixie is thy name, is it not? You have utterly bested me, but thy victory stirred no bitterness within me. Such was its brilliance. Don Atticus! My compadre? It seems this fellow has been dying to speak with you face to face. Don Atticus, please hear what I have to say. I only need a moment. Whatever brought you all the way here? I came to help you. If you don't start going to class again, you'll be expelled from the acad academy, right? When all, the, when all the other kids at school and I were getting bullied real bad, you and the rest of Team Star saved us. Thanks to the operation you carried out, we were all able to go to school again. If we got expelled for being the good guys, that'd be the worst thing ever. Forgive me. Haven't you heard anything from the big boss? Nay. We've heard not a whisper since that fateful day. Without the big boss, Team Star cannot carry on. Without the team, the bright and merry student life we seek lies beyond our reach. We have no choice but to defend our bases till the big boss returns to us. You evidently trust the big boss of yours a great deal. Who exactly are they? In truth, not one of us has met them in the flesh. By their own word, they are a recluse. As with the rest of us, it would be seem bullying to was to blame. Okay, so I was thinking, like, obviously, it seems obvious that Cassiopeia is, like, the big boss. And I was thinking that'd probably make them separate from Penny. Uh, seeing as, I don't know, they just seem like two operating forces, but... Uh, with this information dump, maybe they are the same person, actually, still. Think thonk. That's awful. Though their name and face be unknown to us, they are nonetheless our pe precious comrade. Our only choice was to maintain our vigils on from the bases, awaiting the day of their return. This is also probably true. So that's why you don't go to school. But but still, don't you ever think that Team Star is all you have, Don Atticus? We've got a lifelong com compadre in me, and don't you forget it. My compadre, I owe you a great debt. 
It seems we're one step closer to the truth behind Team Star's truancy and the bullying at the Academy. But more importantly... Like, d dude, you're the principal, man. Like, that's your problem to figure out. I can't believe I had no idea about these... Yeah, that's why all... That's, that's what they all say. Uh, we had no idea. Uh, the students are the... Issues the students are struggling with. They have friendships they hold dear and reasons for acting as they do. I just couldn't see it. It's shameful how oblivious I've been. Ha. Huh. I believe Team Star would be the one and only treasure in my life. Methinks I may have been mistaken. True. True enough. Dixie, it's me. My theme song isn't playing, but that doesn't matter. Atticus the Star Badge is now yours then. I see. Now that its boss has been taken down, the Navi Squad's days are numbered. Now Atticus too. Sorry, I've got a lot on my mind right now. So, Operation Starfall. You've taken down all but two bases, so it's fair to say it's going well. It seems like a good time to let you know that you're, we're ultimately aiming to achieve. Our final goal is to defeat the mastermind that first recruited the five squad bosses and created Team Star. The only that, the one they call the big boss. Who knows? They control the five squad bosses from the shadows. That's all anyone can say. If we de shut up, give me a goal. If we defeated this and get them to declare the team dis disbanded, that'll be it for Team Star. Since the big boss never set up their own base and keeps their identity hidden, I take it they're not one for the spotlight. A bit like Penny, huh? once all the squad bosses are out of action, the big boss will finally have, have to take the stage. Now about your reward, I'll transfer some LP o over to your phone, as promised. Hey. Have your Pokemon learn some strong moves so that they can continue to uh, be of use to the operation. My supply unit rep should be with you soon. Yeah, it's like, is she giving us crypto? Uh, hey there, Vixie. That, uh, sounded like a pretty serious phone call. Ah, I wasn't talking to you. Ah! And then she was eaten again. So that master, <laughs> let me just move on. So that mastermind you were talking about, Cassiopeia has mentioned them to me too. Team Star's founder, the person who's caused all kinds of misery at the academy. If we don't take them down, I'll lose what tr I treasure most in the world. Ah, eh, no, I just... Um, that's right. You need your reward. Here, take it before I forget. Alright, well, I'll be off then. Oh, and Vixie, don't lose to those guys. Righto. Oh, and there's a pit. <laughs> there's a picnic hanging out here. Uh, if I can join it. Sure. Oh, is that a... 
Oh, that's the final Evo, isn't it? That weirdly looks like Godzilla. Like, even, even more blatantly Godzilla-esque than Tyranitar, arguably. Oh. They're having problems with the ball. God, you're huge. Why is Great Tusk so... not Great Tusk, but Iron Dread so tiny compared to you? Eh, I can't move. They're just sort of standing around like, boy, I wish somebody could do anything, do something about this. Oh, oh, is it that, uh... That weird... Tail high kick thing Godzilla does. Yeah, he's fine. He's just a little poisoned. You alright, buddy? Yeah, you're just poisoned. Oh, hey, the ball's free. Neat. And I threw it into you. The jerks. I can't help but feel like a violet. Like I again, I already know what I only know what the Dawn fans look like, so I don't know what else. But I can't help but get the feeling I'm gonna like the Scarlet forms better. Hey, we're in. Okay. Wow, we got bonked in the head like real hard there. Oh. And thus, it was never seen again. Be gone from here, ball. It's like, they came up with ball physics. They're gonna make you use them. Alright. Wait, did I accidentally... I, I can show off this thing I saw on Twitter. Yeah, Miraidon has a malfunction if you spin around. It's kind of cute. Uh, right, I need to heal. Is there a Poke Center around here somewhere? Ooh, Impidimp's here. Uh, not till all the way up there. That's the fighting crew base. I can't help but get the feeling I'm not supposed to be there yet. These two gyms are so close to each other. Alright, I guess we'll explore around this place for a bit -o. Uh, oh hey, Charcadet. Doink. Leaping lizards. Uh, I can crap. Catch a Grafai eye. Uh, you are a lower level than I thought you'd be. Um, ba -ba -ba -ba. Guess you come out. I 
Yeah, it's like, I'm, out of the two legendaries, I like Miraidon better. It's like, they're both cool, but I just like Miraidon a smidge better. Do a minimal amount of damage. I mean, this is a little bit too minimal. Oh well. It's like anything else is probably gonna knock it out, though. I don't get the point of Flatter. It just seems like a worse version of Larvesta. It just seems like a worse version of Swagger. There we go. Yeah, I was wondering where this force was. Hey, I did it. Yay. Each graffiti paints its own individual pattern, and it will paint the same pattern over and over again throughout its life. Okay, maybe I will set up camp. I said, maybe I will set up camp. Then dismount it for me. Gosh dang it. Why are you like this? Okay. I don't know if you want to join in sandwich, but get off the table. Get your dog off the table. Gosh. Like, I don't know if you want to join in sandwich making. Let's try to do that. Okay, two out of two. Let's do it. Uh, I guess it doesn't super matter. Do you have any preference, Seth? Like, do you need a particular encounter power or something? Okay, I just fix anything. Uh, basic cheese sandwich. Let's do it. Yeah, sure, whatever. Okie doke. Seems like a, a, lot, a lot of things that are not quite cheese. No, I was gonna do that. This is horrid. I didn't know I was gonna include hot dogs, but okay. What the hell is this? We did it! Mm -mm, I can't have a sandwich without. Most of it being bread, and also there's some sausage links on specifically the left side and nowhere else.
Okay, spicy apparently. Whatever cures poison, I guess. Well, hey, poison types will be big. That's handy. Okay. Uh, let me set up. Because I guess I'll make my way toward this Pokemon Center. Generally speaking. I, I'm not entirely sure... What's the next intended destination? What is left? Flying Chews. Okay, we got this whole corner up here. You. And you down here. And this thing. Right. Okay, I'll explore around here and I guess we can head to the psychic gym. I'm over prepared for that one because gosh knows I got enough ghost types for it. Oh, don't fall down there. That'd be issues. Okay, okay. Can I not participate in it then? Ooh, zinc. What's that? What does that give again? Special defense. Can you eat any more Eevees? Sure can. Defense. Uh, yeah, you can go ahead and do that. Is it? I don't. I don't know. I haven't looked at the level map in a while. Who would be best given defense? I'm not sure. I guess maybe. I'd probably rather use HP ups. I want to make you able to take a hit better. No, I wanted. Ghost, then psychic, okay. Okay. the menu. Raid question mark? I think that's, yeah, because that's the Cyclozar icon. Water type, A. Come on out here, Calabari. Alright. Wouldn't mind a Rotom.
Can I put you to sleep? Oh, okay. Fine. Worth a shot, I guess. Oh, that might be because you were uproaring. Your terra ground, right? Whoops. We did it. Managed. Pinkurchin just has to get that revenge hit. Resolving all your actions, game. Game. <laughs> okay. It's like they sped up rays, but then they get slowed back down by the game being weird. Terra shards what you use to change a Terra type. Oh, that's a lot, but okay. Understandable. Did it. Research continues on this Pokemon, which could be the power source of a unique motor. your lower le lowest level. Uh, who needs a map? Oh, uh, you're a bit too late for that, buddy. Okay, can I beat you down before you cause problems? Let's find out. Hey, you're faster than a Pelper. That's uh I'm blanking on the name. Glamora. It's like a one percent encounter in caves. Or it's pre evolution is a one percent encounter in caves. I'm gonna run around with him for a bit. Does it evolve 
Did I already ask this? Does it evolve one more time, or is that a set? Oh, you're kind of slow. Ah. Uh, ooh, gimme... Not gimme ghoul. Uh. Wait, no! Dang it. I didn't mean to do that. No! Glamora, stop. Stop terrorizing the wildlife. Lamora, hit Impidimp. Okay, um, why are you so low level? Okay, uh, quick ball, I guess. Turn one quick ball. There we go. Did it. They live in groups, pestering and playing pranks on each other to polish their troublemaking skills. That's really funny in concept. Okay, Nito. Uh, what's that? Just the pig. What's over here? A lake. Uh, it leads life. Alright, I forgot to look at TM's. Yeah, can anyone learn X Scissor? You can learn X Scissor. Oh, you can learn X Scissor. Hell yeah. Oh. I don't know those are the same power. Mmm. Does an X scissor have a higher crit chance? I'm gonna hold off on that then. Uh, leech life. You can also learn leech life. Huh, I kind of swear that's what X Scissor did. Hmm. Okay, I need to get to a Pokemon Center. Which I could just fly to one, but let's make our way to this one over here just to keep a move on to new places. Time is it? Okay. It's not too late. Yeah, squeeze me. Oh, Mimikyu! Rightio. Uh. Observe. Uh, the, the disguise wasn't the only thing that was busted. Wait, why'd you take damage? Do you take damage anyway? It's kind of weird. See, I remember the days back in Gen 7 when I would use my frickin' Z-Move first turn against Totem Mimikyu and then it got wasted on its frickin' disguise. Dang it. 
Yeah, but in Sun and Moon, it, like, completely negated the first attack. There we go, finally. The flowers celebrate. Mimikyu only recently identified... Oh, Mimikyu was only recently identified as a Pokemon. Previously, people thought it was just a ghost wearing a cloth. To be fair, that feels like it should classify as a Pokemon. <laughs> I don't know why that wouldn't classify as a Pokemon. Can I hear more? I don't know if the cries are like... Indicative of Pokemon that are like actually out at this very moment. Gotta study hard. What the heck just happened? Uh, yeah, dark type squabbit, who cares? What's that? Oh, just shrewdle. Never mind. I guess like there's something up with this. Like, it feels like I ought to mess with this and it summons a Korok or something. Oh, you fight. Oh. Is it version exclusive for me? Okay, that's weird. Well, there's I saw Passimian earlier. Okay, weird. Yeah, because when we're e exiting the poison camp, there's like a pack of Passimians. I should weaken it and then send it to sleep. It's a version exclusive caught. This Pokemon lives quietly in the depths of the forest. The purple cape like fur gets longer and longer as Oranguru ages. Alrighty. Well, that's neat. Okay, uh, you're just a spider. I don't need you. Oh, you're just a fungus. Uh, how do I... Is there a way to get up? Strangeness. Uh, 
where's this? Mm. Can I not actually get out of here? What do you guys got to say for yourselves? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Okay, then. They're just there, I guess. Ah, uh, there's past salmon, past salmon over here. I need one too. sleep. Now, it would be funny if, if because there's like a squad of five past them in here. Oh, don't knock yourself out. Okay, good. Because there's a squad of past same in here, it would count five, but apparently not. That seems weird, because there's only one Titan left. It's funny seeing two wild battles going on at the same time. There we go. Alright. The boss chooses ten members of the group to go out hunting. The hunting party will eventually split the food they find with the rest of the group. Okay, well, I guess I can't go any further this way. Okay, I just don't want, I just don't want to make sure I, like, wander too far away and then these passing and despawn or something. Go in. There we go. I gave you the Miraidon of good luck. me. Okay, uh, since we can't go this way, I take that off. Uh, I get, I get okay, I get, apparently, blah, blah, blah. apparently, ghost gym leader is next on the intended gym order. So, I guess we'll go all the way back down here. Start climbing this away. Uh, actually, real quick, let me go get another drink.
wrong buttons. I'm not ex not exclusive to pressing the wrong ones of those on uh, just on stream or on the controller. All right. I thought you said snoms falling down. Don't drop your snom. Uh. Well, <laughs> our first crash, everybody. Well, that happened. I have autosave on, so I can't imagine it sent me back too far, but... Well, I had to, it had to happen eventually, I guess. Game optimize great. Poison guy still beat? Yeah, poison the guy still beat, so. Alrighty, well. That caused a problem. I could. Dang it. Leave me alone. I'm just trying to pick items up. It's like very. Uh, do you want to reconnect? Oh, okay. Um. As soon as I remember which button is the right one, there we go. Let's go again. Are we really going to drag, drag us all the way back to Mesagosa? Oh, did you also want to join? Try this again. Yes, 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 yes. Wait, no, shush. Okay, there's the code. too late now. Ba 
I would say, as far as game feel goes, alright, now let's go. As far as game feel goes, I would still say Legend Arceus wins out, most definitely, because it still feels like, it kind of feels like crap to accidentally bump into a Pokemon and then you're just shunted into like a 15 second distraction. Hey. Which corner of the universe am I shunted to now? Where am I? Oh, Medali. Alright, fly back again. Yeah, I had a real, really bad chain yesterday. Where I just got, got kept getting bonked from random battle to random battle and it just kept shunting me into other random battles up to the point where my Pokemon got knocked out because I got knocked into a Pokemon that was like 10 levels above it. Okay. Okay, can I fight you without the game shitting its pants this time? There we go. I got Gastron, that's potentially a problem. Why are you not healed? Oh, okay, whatever. Weird. I gotta posture check myself. Psybeam's a little redundant, so why not? We can baton pass the a, 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 uh, oh, not a Gastrodon. A Calm Mind or two. Maybe. Possibly. Decent posture here. Okay. Okay. Apparently, since I didn't heal, let me go do that real quick. That's right here, anyways. I might have restock on. Balls while I'm at it. Oh, right. Uh, I'm being rude as the, the host of this team. Uh, I'm checking all the stuff like now of all times. You can learn iron defense, really. Okay. Seems odd. I guess not the oddest thing in the universe, because you're a suit of armor, but still. Flash cannon, spikes. I 
I wish it labeled which ones are new, because I'm not sure which is new and which is stuff I already had. Sell this crap. Yeah, what's I can bulk sell. There we go. Dink. There we go. I think I received everything. That's cute. Okay. That's easier. Okay. Oh, good. I can buy ultra balls now. Sweet. balls can I buy? Yeah, stuck up on luxury balls a bit. Just in case. Yeah, I can buy hyper potions now. Alright, we should be good. Come back again? I probably will. Right, the sun snowstorms back. It's like, thanks, I can't see. I especially couldn't see that Larvitar there. Uh, just light tap you with ancient power. Again with ancient power. Ye. Up. Oh. All the stats. Yeah, that's fine at all, but. Oh, shoot, you got earthquake. Of course, you got a ground move. Well, you know what? Good thing you got that stat boost. to sleep also. being so angry. No. Go in. The cried on of good luck. Yes. It is born deep underground. It can't emerge until it has entirely consumed the soil around it. Alrighty. Larvitar, get. Jump hype. As soon as I can get out of here. Okay, well that was a pleasant thing to accidentally stumble into. I don't think I've even seen the Larvitar yet. Uh, you a trainer? You sure are. Isn't Bagon version exclusive? If one of you wants it. Or any of you wants it. Okay, uh... 
Uh, let me heal phase on real quick. Oh, I don't know. Larva yeah, I guess that makes sense. Because I've been making pseudos version exclusive lately. So that makes sense. Oh boy. Blissey. Wishing I had Toxic on you. This thing's ass. <laughs> it's always funny when Blissey has a dramatic attack animation because then it does nothing damage. Hey Ryan, I'm stuck with Blissey Hell for all eternity. Never mind. Bar, bar, bar. Oh, you get first impression. Uh. God, you get so many good bug moves. Eh, I think first impression now does sucker punch a little bit. To me, anyways. Of course, like, Golisopod is the best user of that move. Just thanks to the whole uh, thingamaroll. Like high dunce bars. Are you high enough level? When does it learn the drill move that it needs to learn to evolve? I think he said it's 38. God, the mice are attacking me. Wait, why does that tandem mouse have more mice? That's really an evolved form. Okay, okay, that's kind of funny actually. <laughs> Done sparse. Quit being a jerk. Now you go to sleep. Use my last dust ball on you, though. This poor Dunsparce. It's just trying to exist, but it's getting harassed.
Okay. Nope. I just want to evolve you. Real quick here. Because you have... Is Hyper Drill the one that needs to... No. So, like, I just need to evolve it. Or level it up. Okay. Burr, burr, burr. Eh, no thanks. Alright, how many segments are you gonna have? Two, okay. Average. It drives enemies out of its nest by sucking in air to fill its long, narrow lungs, then releasing the air in an intense blast. I feel like the only thing you could do to make Dadun Sparse better would be if its name was Redun Sparse. As in redundant. I think that'd be really funny. Okay. Dink. Alrighty. Oh, and you can get its four segment evol evolve form. Okay, I can't imagine what form specific shiny hunting would be like. If it's a three segment form, is apparently so rare. resembling fine. Yeah, because poison negates the fighting weakness. You missed a giant floating mineral. How do you feel? Growth is fine and all, but yeah. Look, I have a hundred percent encounter or one percent encounter in here. I think I'm fine. Okay, on to the big outdoors. Mountain, mountain, mountain. I expect to see Go Go out here. You a big guy? Thick fat is where it's at. Sure is. Oh, you're weak to my poison shenanigans. Oh wait, maybe not, because you're dark type. Oh, never mind. I thought dark resisted poison, but oh well. Apparently not. Wug trio? Well. Sure. Uh, yeah, get out of here.
Ha. Finally, toxic to break came in handy. Okay, here's the question. Can you outspeed it? Yes, you can. Hey. Well, hey, when you're nice and toasty, that's W to me. Okay, uh, slack off for- I'm surprised I haven't seen a slack off. Oh, that's just my bray. Where's this exactly? Uh, look at You can find wild Umbreon? Really? That seems like a big deal. What was that? Oh, that's you guys. Never mind. Oh, really? I haven't been ramming into trees because I don't know they somehow don't read as a rampable thing. It's like they explained it when I got the charge, but then I tried it twice and then nothing happened. Then I was like, shrug. What's that? Ooh. Neat. What's this? Oh, it's Seth's crystal. Electro ball. I don't think anybody I have can learn that. What are we up against? Oh, uh, Growlithe. Fair enough. Oh, I guess that makes sense. Because I, I have seen from watching someone else play uh, Tarantula in trees, so... Just need to say everybody's attack fell. Come on. <laughs> that sure was a battle. Uh, sure, I guess. so stoked about acrobatics when they first add it in Gen 5. Especially after I learned Sceptile could learn it. Ooh, a bunch of pearls. Neat. Now, the, the real strat is unburdened flying gem acrobatics. I didn't have Growlithe. It's very friendly and faithful to people. It will try to repel enemies by barking and biting. That's a dog, all right.
Okay. Uh, further up the mountain, then? Seems like, what is that? Can't, that might just be, oh, it's just Gabite, never mind. Is that Py I think Pyroar's main is like giving a light. Oh, okay, bye. Giving a light ambient glow. That's kind of neat. What is art? A good question for not many people. Oh, get a second chance at catching you. Okay, let's gently knock it down this time. Gently. Ye. God dang it. Yeah, I'm picking on this Grievard. Don't judge me. I can't stay asleep. Now, great ball. Mice will oversee it. Violence is in the background. How lovely. This friendly Pokemon doesn't like being alone. Pay it even the slightest bit of attention, and it will follow you forever. Oh, does it just evolve by level? Okay. We can do that. Real quick, like here. As soon as I press the right button. Burr, burr, burr. Is it nighttime? It looks like nighttime. Uh. I mean, it's dawn. Eh, yeah, it didn't count. Dang it. Okay. Gotta keep that in mind then. Oh, hi, Snob. I didn't see you there. Woo woo woo. Oh, that's a snow rat. Look, Snob is just really good at. You shiny. Uh, no. It just looks like it. Ooh, bird might. Don't have one of those. It's 
ancient power gentle enough? Dang it. Nope. Rip. The uh, hut. Uh, hi. I need to run into you. It's fine. Oh, wild Glaceon. <laughs> Guess we could vector this. Crunch, really. Stop that. Stop that. I was about to ask why is Crab Crab Brawler all the way up here, but I guess I guess Crab Abominable. Berg bike protects itself by coating its body and ice formed by frigid air of negative 148 degrees Fahrenheit. It fights with frigidbacks whenever they want, or whenever they meet. Dink. All right. Uh, surely I have. Wrong button. Surely I have. Crab baller. Leave me alone. Okay. It must be playing, pressing every wrong button in the universe. Here. Ba 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 ba. Ooh, ten quick balls. I'll take that. Okie doke. Ooh, Snover. I can't help it. I'm easy to distract. Oh, that doesn't summon hail anymore? Huh. Huh, okay then. You know what, weirdly enough, the fact that it doesn't cause- that hail doesn't- well, quote-unquote hail no longer causes damage is, like, weirdly enough, a buff to it. Because now it can finally just have synergy with ice teams that aren't... that don't have to fully be ice types. I can just get in here. Seemingly curious about people, they gather around footsteps they find on sn snowy mountains. Tw 
Clink. Yeah, I'm righty. Uh, this map is not too terribly useful. Kind of just have to feel your way around, I guess. Oh, is that Cryogonal? Oh, huh. That hi, dearling. Saw his back. And then Cryogonal died. Question mark. Okay then. E. Hi. Quick. Yourself included, huh? Oh, that face. You look like you're a reference to like really old Dragon Tamer designs. Violence, it's happening. Right as we speak. Eh, uh, come here, you. Why not? Please, thank you. I hope Crab Crab Roller gets a split Evo one of these days. Cause like Crab is fine, I just don't want it to be an evolution of Crab Roller. Though its punches are powerful, this Pokemon's movements are sluggish. It blows icy bubbles from its mouth to immobilize opponents. Doink. Give me that. Hi. Oh, does it give me a on top of it? I hadn't even noticed. Okay, this is Grusha's place, which... From what I hear, Grusha's the last... Or the highest level gym leader. So best not me mess with him for now. Yes, sir. Ma'am. Them, if you are so inclined. Snowscape. Oh, that's just replacement for hail. Okay. Because like, I bet ice hail, t like quote unquote hail teams, are gonna be like way more viable now. Like, not that I'm a competitive nut, mind you, but... Is this really all there is in this town? Yeah, it's just the gym and a Pokemon Center. Okay, it's hardly even a town. I think Crowgonal's neat. Ch 
swing. Great ball, yeah. This whole mountain is his domain. I'll throw an Ultra Ball at you. I can buy them now. I can afford to be less stingy. That's not an excuse to break out of them. uses the chains of ice to constrict its opponents and then flash freezes them where they stand. Yeah, Crygon is like terrifying just in concept. Like imagine a snowflake was sentient and also it was a predator. <laughs> okay, um Where's that? Oh, that's just where we're at. Okay, right. I yeah, keep going this way. Huh, Wild Gardevoir can be here. Interesting. like it. Uh, no, you're pointing this way, actually. What's that down there, then? Oh, that, I guess. Okay. I wish there's an icon on the... Or not icon, but... What word am I thinking of? An arrow pointing which direction you're looking at. Couldn't deploy the wings again, but oh well. Watch dish ding. Uh, I got a ground giraffe rig. Boop boop. I got challenge the group. Yeah, I just forgot to change it. And I keep forgetting to change it. I mean, if we want to be technical, how many days, how many day-night cycles have passed in this game already? I think out of all the ty the terror type hats ground is the funniest. Yeah, seed bomb it. Explode. If you would be so kind. Oh, that would have been funny, actually. <laughs> we brought all these grass-type moves in.
I can absolutely thinking it wouldn't it be would it be kind of funny if whenever we get around to doing uh, the Gen 9 reviews if we reviewed all the uh, terrestrializing hats that'd be kind of funny I haven't seen the steel one yet No, I'm attached to... what? No, Seth's crystal. That sounds, as what one would say, metal as fuck. Oh, there are melt ice. Oh, hey, Delbird. Yeah, respawn to Seth's thing. Dang it. Rip. Okay. I heard Snow are freaking out. Oh, this man's in pain. Let's go pester him. Why don't they have the courier guys riding? Like, I don't know, at the very least on the backs of Cyclozar. You can hit or fit. Excuse me. Be gone with you. And now you can be in emotional pain along with physical pain. Like, I'm just a Pokemon protagonist. I can't help you there. Okay, Ethord. This looks fancy. Curly or uh, I guess we could just fight it, fight it. If nothing else for the candies. If anyone if anyone else wants it. Kill nigh the violence guy. Kill, 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 kill. <laughs> Quick, get your attack it. Nope, oh, okay. Beat me to it. Actually, I don't, I don't think I have a antenna, so I guess I should catch it. 
See, there was no, there, there was no chance to get a, another move in because uh, that not, not not Gojira just like ate it. God Chiller sounds like a badass name. Okay. I have Hatena now. I guess I don't think I had it before. It senses the feelings of other living creatures, but be careful not to expose it to strong emotions for too long, or it will end up exhausted. Ugh, relatable buddy. Okay, here in town. Okay, I'm gonna post to Splatoon 3 verse. This is weirdly the cheeriest sounding like what's supposed to be a ghost town. Lavender town, this is not. Is that a place I can go in? Yes. All oh, right, you can just buy proteins. They're expensive as hell, but you can buy them. So chilly, so stiff, so... What was the other thing? Oh, you got a shiny Noibat? Lucky. It's like, I would say I'm surprised I haven't seen a shiny yet. But at the same time, I've probably walked past shinies without realizing it. in town. Cheek kebab. What kind of restaurant has two many? Uh, I guess a stand, food stand. Not a restaurant. Is this the same old, same old? Oh, it's a proper sandwich shop. I now have knowledge of more sandwichitude. That much is the same old, same old. See, like, sandwiches being such a, like, widespread Paldean thing just makes it seem like this place is... Or Subway has taken over this place like McDonald's has the whole world. Okay, here's an ingredient shop. Some of those. What do I not have? Don't have cucumbers. Don't have avocados. Red onions. Oh, you can make long hamburgers. I've always wanted to try something stupid like that, like put hamburger buns on sub bread and just have a really long hamburger that vinegar would do Muriel proud uh, basil I apparently have not 
have been missing out on a lot of ingredients. Yellow pepper, fried filet. Alrighty. Oh, okay. I guess that's why. Collect a bunch of gym badges, then I forgot. Uh, what else is in town? Are there any cosmetic shops? Doesn't look like it. This town is small. Uh, what's all this? Oh, it's another base. Probably. Yeah. Alrighty. Well, uh, the stream's a little shorter than usual because I started so late, but it's getting kind of late still, so I'm probably going to call it there, and we'll save the gym for next time. Oh, that's kind of funny. We had fun times with funny lizards running around and me pressing the wrong button all, at all times. There we go. And, uh, we had no, I think, was this the first episode where we had, like, no major team updates? Possibly. Just ended up sticking with Glamora here, because Glamora's pretty cool. It shows me its butt and doesn't know anyone else's business. Yeah, I know, right? It's like, again, I can't praise... It's like, it's, it's one of those ideas I wish I thought of, like, just some weird undersea creature, but it's a cave creature instead. It's neat. And it has so much heartless energy, too. Like, Kingdom Hearts, Heartless. Oh, did you just evolve that Noibat? Oh, hey. I got a shiny on stream. It's not mine, but... It's a shiny on stream. I bet shiny's pretty cool. It's one of those shinies I wish I got. But tragically, cannot. Okay, uh, that is a good idea. Let me... Ba -ba -ba. Everybody want to pose? Because I pose. Lamora might not participate, but... Wow, it's a shiny Noibat. Noivern. I found it on my own. Behold, I'm holding an egg. The egg has awoken. Oh god, it's getting larger. Okay, anyway. Oh uh, yeah, thank everybody for watching. Uh, probably around the same time tomorrow, usual time. We'll fight... Oh uh, yeah, fight uh, the ghost gym leader. Yeah, shush. Fight the ghost gym leader, and then... Uh, I don't know if I can fight that yet. It just, it just seems like that weird to... It seems like it'd be weird to end uh, the Titan quest when I still have, like, two more gym leaders to fight and two more Team Star Goons to fight. 
Uh, anyway, yeah. Uh, see y'all tomorrow if you if you're there.